What's up friends, Matthew here, and we are back at the Disney Character Warehouse to check out all the amazing discounted Disney merchandise that you can grab right now at this outlet mall here in Orlando. So let's go ahead and take a look around the store and see what goodies we can find. Well, this is pretty cool. The first thing that we're gonna see is a Disney 100 Decades collection, Mr. Toad and the Headless Horseman. Shocking to see the Disney 100 Decades stuff already end up at the Character Warehouse. These are $20. This is part of the series. They were $50. They're nice little wind-up pullback toys. Kind of like a nice little retro thing that you can grab from that decade collection. I don't really have an order of what I want to show the store in. I kind of just took a walk around and you know what? We're just going to show a little bit of everything because there's a lot of stuff to look at. So they got the Arisa Cat toys and these are some of those fun little dog toys. They've got little squeaker items that go inside of the wheel of cheese. As you can see there's like a little salmon and stuff like that. So some fun stuff. Those are $13. They were $25. These awesome little ceramic bowls for cats or dogs. These are $8. They also have another style from the Aristocats. These are going for $8 as well. They were 20, nice little ceramic bowl. And if we turn around, we see all of the other dog stuff. So they've got lots of dog costumes right now in varying shapes and sizes, as well as looks like little kid t-shirts. So looks like the order is just kind of all over the place, but you can see the chill out pet bandanas. Those are $8. There's that nice little sign. If we look closer at some of these other little jerseys, I don't know if these are spirit jerseys or not. These are only 10 bucks. That's such a great deal if you're dressing up your dogs. You do want to make sure you measure your dogs before you buy anything. My dog is about a 75 pound dog and the XL is very tight on him. So if they had like a double XL, that's what we'd buy for him. He's just got a very girthy neck. These are $16, they were $40 and they've got a variety of other things like these really cute pet collars. Those look a little bit larger. Those are $10 as a medium. You would think that these would just be for cats, but that'd be one giant cat. I think that is a dog collar. They have cat toys and like travel bowls. Those are really nice to have if you're a road tripper. Always good to have. The Haunted Mansion pet costume down below is $15. It comes with that little hat, the, the hats and the, uh, the, the ghost, uh, my brain, the hat, bo hat box ghost. There it is. I think that, at least I think it is. So lots of really fun little things for your dogs, varying in price, mostly down to that ten dollar mark and as we go around you can see they still have lots of these ghost candles they are still five dollars they smell amazing we're gonna skip over the christmas section for right now just because there is a lot of other stuff that we could show that's not christmas or halloween because we showed that a lot when we do these videos so let's go find some newer stuff the clothing sale is still going on and they have lots of heli hannah ja heli hansen jackets for a great price they're 50 percent off plus another 30 percent so well, not 50. These are were 185 down to 125 plus 30 percent off. It's a really great deal on some really high quality jackets. So you want to be sure to look through that. And they have a really good selection in sizes and the styles you can see there. So we're just kind of going through. We're not going to go through all the prices of everything because it's there's a lot. And we try to keep these videos a little shorter than we used to because they were getting really long there for a while. This was like 30 dollars. It was 110. Part of that National Geographic collection plus that 30 percent off that's still going on which is shocking. Usually that doesn't last this long. It's been going on for a couple months. Nice hooded sweatshirts down to $50. Plus that additional 30% off, plus the vest, some cool stuff here. I think these are reversible. Oh no, they're not reversible. What are these going for? These are going for 65. They were $200 vests. And then they had the black style as well. Only $65. What a fantastic deal. So let's take a look around. I'm sure there's lots of really cool stuff to see. Even more jackets right next to that other quad rack. These are only $30, nice windbreaker jackets. We're 60. Got a good variety in sizes there, extra small, medium, large, and they've got the mustard color uh, rain jackets, which are really nice, those Heli Hansen jackets. Again, as you can see, $75 at 30% off. Another really good deal. So, moving right along. These are a little bit thicker Heli Hansen jackets. Definitely built for some cold weather stuff. And then these are, do believe are rain jackets. They have that feel to them like they would be rain jackets. That part of that Jasmine collection there. Those are a little bit cheaper down to $40, we're $80. And here is a better look at those rain jackets. These are not Heli Hansons, these are Helux. Oh no, they are Heli Hansen, so it's just an odd style. But it's a really well built jacket. If you're in the market for a pet bed, this is a great place to stop and get one, only 25 bucks. 
nice for small and medium pets, probably not anything large. This would be a little bit too small for my dog Murphy, but he would, he would, he'd be able to curl into it. He, I think he'd just be uncomfortable, but this would be really good for, you know, 40 pound dogs, 45 pound dogs and smaller. You could put a bunch of blankies in there for your little doggies. Only 25 bucks. We're gonna change things up and show the kids clothing a little bit earlier in the video for those that have asked about it several times. They've got some of these. This is a boy section. This are the Wakanda Forever $8 long sleeves. There are a couple different options and sizes in these awesome little jackets for Mickey Mouse. These are really cool, they're super cute. Got Mickey all over them. They're only $20. They were $40 when they, 40 or $50? They were $50 when they first came out. So, and remember, there's that, there's that sign. There's a, th take the 30% off. Additional, they also have lots of Strange World stuff. Those are only 10 bucks, they were 20. Some Thor shirts. Raise your hammer for Asgard, only $8. Lots of Wakanda Forever, more of that. And this is really soft, which is nice. This is part of that sensory friendly. And that is very, very nice on the inside. Those are $13, they were 35. Another Wakanda Forever t-shirt. Nothing on the back side of that. I hate that they just don't put the tags all in the same spot. Those are only $8. It was a $27 t-shirt. From Turning Red, these are $15. They were $40. On the back side, you can see the Pandemonium Panda. Get a better look at that. There you go. And then there, once again, is that shirt. So, down below, it's a little bit harder to look at this stuff because it's all crammed in here, but we'll do our best to look at it. Show some of it, like, oh, the Obi-Wan Kenobi shirts some different tank tops. I think those are just kind of plain tank. Those are just Marvel tank tops. They don't really have anything on them. And those are $13. They were, this was a $45 tank top. No branding, no nothing. It says Marvel, but that's a tag. Um, I'm just gonna say right off the bat that that's ridiculous. That was $45. Now it's $13. You know what? I wouldn't even pay $13 for that. I'd pay $5 for that. I think that's a little outrageous. Like this shirt was cheaper. This is a much cooler shirt. And it's 14, well it's $15 now. It was $40 in the parks. We don't talk about Bruno. I think they still have a bunch of this style in the parks or they changed up their Bruno shirts in the parks. Those are $13. That's a really cute Mickey shirt. Lots of fun little one. Droid Depot shirts here as well. You can kind of get a good look at those with R2-D2 on there. There's that Captain America. We've seen that one. It says language on the backside. Captain Huckin, his uh, shield at Loki. And then lots of Star Wars shirts, Hawkeye shirts, Wakanda Forever shirts. So lots of those uh, movies that have been out for a while that have made their way to Disney Plus. Lots of those here. And then even more of the Obi-Wan Kenobi shirts. So we've seen a lot of these style shirts. That's not those. These Star Power shirts. They've been here for a while. They're still $13. But like I said, that 13% disc, 30% extra discount, always good to have. That's a fun Donald shirt. I only have that in large though. They do have some spirit jerseys for kids. Those are part of last year's Pride Collection, the Star Wars Pride Collection. The new Pride Collection is out. We just did a video on that. That will probably make its way to the character warehouse very shortly. Now that Pride Month has concluded, it usually sticks around for a couple months and then by the fall, it's here pretty quick. I'm always shocked when new clothing lines end up at the character warehouse as fast as they do, but they do from time to time. That's a really cool Millennium Falcon shirt. I showed it earlier. Those are still $20. You know, that 30% discount helps, but man, eat, sleep, watch, repeat. That's a really fun shirt. What does that go for? That's $13. They've got a bunch of those different sizes for kids, extra small, extra larges kind of all out of order here in terms of what is available. Some cool Droid Depot shirts. That's kind of a fun shirt there. You can see it's like a tank top with a shirt underneath. It's a little weird. $13, but hey, if that's your style, that's your style. Here's some more of the larger size of that jacket that we saw earlier. They've got Mickey pants to go with it. Those are kind of cool. All the tags have been ripped off. Those are only 15 bucks. More Mickey pants. Those were 35, they're down to 15. And then looks like they've got some board shirts. Those look like they're, those are pretty big youth sizes. Those are like adult sizes, 28, 14. That's like on the verge of being an adult. Those are $20. Good pair of board shorts. And they've got these fun shirts down here with Raja on there. Those are really fun. I don't think they made that. That's the Illy Forever. I don't know if they made those for adults. Those are $20. Those are pretty fun. Looks like it comes with a little undershirt as well. 
and then more of the Wakanda Forever. So there you go, there's the boys section. Some good stuff there, some other swim trunks with Mickey Mouse on them. Some fun little section, we haven't done that in a while. Sticking with the kids clothing, we'll look at the girls section as well. They've got a few things that are hung up, but they have a lot of stuff down below. Those things that we've shown up top, we've shown before. I'll show you once again, we've got these awesome little dresses and, and sweaters that go over the top. Very cool, very fun looking. Lots of blankets and, and those are those frozen blankets. Those have been here a while. I wonder what those are costing now. They're still 25 bucks, which is a really good deal. It's a really very high quality throw blanket. And they also have some beach towels too. There's the design on that. So it looks like it's Moana and, so it's Moana and Rapunzel hanging out. Those are $20, they were 30. Not bad for a beach towel, but let's see what is down below. We got this awesome sweater, mini. Those are going for $19 fun little skirt that is a very little skirt extra extra small size two those are $15 they were $40 skirts they have a bunch of these shirts from Buzz Lightyear those are $10 as you can see there's a whole bunch of them different variety of sizes as well continuing right along pandemonium shirts so some stuff that's out of order those these princess shirts here those are really cute they've got a few different ones there so we'll kind of go through all of these. Today is my favorite day. Kids shirts are pretty well discounted, typically in that $13, $14 range. Some of them as low as $7. Looks like all these are in that $13 range though, which is pretty good. Plus, you know, that extra 30% off. Looks like got a bunch of different styles here. Kindness is everything with our princesses. All right. And there we go. I move mountains. That's a great shirt from that's only $10, it was $25, and that is from Encanto. More Wakanda Forever shirts, we saw those earlier in the boys section. So sometimes they get the boys and the girls clothes all combined. This Tomorrowland tank top, I feel like has been here since we started doing these videos. A lot of the times the, the girls section and the, and the kids clothing um, ends up staying a really long time. Which is kind of, you know, funny because like, these are only $8 right now. They do that 30% off sale every now and then. You can get a really good deal on some clothing. There's a droid shirt, we saw that earlier. Choose Your Own Destiny, this is another Star Wars top that's been here for quite a while. It is a long sleeve, it is $8. It's always challenging to buy long sleeves here in Florida because you just never know when you're gonna use it again. But here's a really cool spirit jersey. See those little polka dots down below? It's the only one they have, it's 25 bucks, it was 55 and it's an extra large. The Women of Star Wars, that's a cool top. Those are $25, they got a bunch of different styles there. Ahsoka, there we go, nice Ahsoka shirt. Some pride shirts down here as well. Monsters U, that funky looking top we saw earlier. Mother, more Monsters U, more Star Wars shirts. So we're getting into some repeats here. Let's see what's above. So they've got more beach towels, these are only 15. And then up here we've got the, the Mighty Thor shirt to match Thor, $13. And there's that Wakanda Forever shirt as well. So a lot of repeat sections, a lot of repeat items. Let's see what else we can find down here. The, the Main Street Electrical Parade shirts. Those have been here for a, quite a while. Let's see, what else is there? Aloha from the Polynesian Resort. Those are $13. More of those frozen Long sleeves and sweatpants. These have been here for quite a while. Got some panda leggings. Those are $13. You can see different styles there. Those are from, uh, look at the pandemonium from turning red. And then we get into some shorts. I don't see any new shorts, but here they are. These are what they're currently available. Those are $13. More leggings, the, the electrical parade, Marvel leggings. Mickey head leggings. Leggings are typically 10 to $13. You can see a variety of prices as we go through here. $13, $9, $10. And they've got some awesome little hats too. It's a weird time to buy hats for everybody because it's summertime, but it's a really cool princess hat. Nice big old poof ball on there. And these are $40 still. They were 55, which is odd. It's summertime. You'd think they'd want to discount that and get rid of them. But if you're looking for a hat, you're looking for a really nice knit hat. You can get a really good hat here. And these are Love Your Melon, I believe that's a, some sort of name brand, $40 for those. And then I've got these sweaters here. I believe these are from Frozen, maybe. They're $20, but I'm not seeing any sort of brand. I mean, you see the ice. 
I would guess this is frozen. It's like the seasons, right? It's all the seasons. More shirts up top. The Miss Marvel shirt. The Doctor Strange shirt, only $10. And here is another spirit jersey. $30 for that one. You can see it's got the floral patterns. And this is really cool. This is all stitched on there. Very well put together. They have that in extra small only. They also have accessories like these Milan accessory kits. These are clip-on earrings. Those are $8. They were $17.95. And they also have headbands for $8 as well. And additional style headbands from Frozen and Jasmine. And those are $14. They also have some fuzzy zip-up unicorn tops. Sweatshirts. Look at that. You can see all the different uh, Pixar characters that they put on there. These are so soft. There's the unicorn that's stitched on, and these are going for $20. Let's try and get a better look at that. So there's that unicorn, unicorn coming out of the pocket. It's so soft. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. Really cool frozen jacket, too. They've just got a handful of those. Those are $25. They were $65. And then they have some Avatar jackets. Now, these are not as fuzzy. They do look fuzzy. They'd be nice and warm. Those are $30. And they are reversible, so here's the inside, there's the outside, so you get to see them. It's like buying two jackets, right? Always loved getting jackets like that. They also have the unicorn blanket to match that um, match that hooded sweatshirt. And it is wearable, so it has a hood on it. So you can see, there you go. And let's see what those go for. Those are going for $30. They were $50 when they were in the parks. More of those towels, the same towel we saw earlier. And then some cute little shoes. I have no idea what movie or theme these are from. You can take your best guess in the comments. So we examine these. These are $8. They also have things like, like little skirts. Look at these are petticoats, I think, $10. Princess light up petticoat, so it lights up. Very cool. And then we get into the dress section. So, oh, they, these are frozen. These have got to be frozen. Yep, they're frozen. Because they match this dress, and this is a frozen dress. So we have answered that question for ourselves, $25. They also have the Tiana's tops, and look, these are a skirt top combo. Those are going for $20, they were 45. Then they have the Tiana princess dresses, they have the Belle princess dresses, those are only 20 bucks. And then they get into some kid cupcake aprons so you can do some baking together. And then lots of Strange World stuff. So lots of Strange World things that you can grab. I didn't see the movie, I honestly don't have any interest in seeing this movie, it looked kind of goofy and Weird. If you did see it and you liked it, let me know. Maybe you can convince me to watch it. If you watched it and you're like, now nah, you can skip it, also let me know. That way I don't have to waste time or, you know what, it might be really good and maybe I will spend an evening checking it out. So let me know in the comments what you thought, if you saw it. So this is a really cool find. This is a picture frame. It's a hanging Mickey picture frame. And here it is out of the box. They put a postcard in it. It is gorgeous. This is such a cool find. These are only $8. They were $25 in the parks. They got a whole slew of them here. Although Brittany is here live shopping with our group. So I'm very confident that these will not last very long. Very awesome find here at the Character Warehouse. You don't see items like that too often. And when you do, they're usually gone pretty fast. They do still have the Bambi through. Those are $25 as well as the Bambi mug going for $8. Very cool mug. And they still have a ton of stuff from Alice in Wonderland in that teacup collection. Here's the mug at saucer and infuser. So that is a little tea infuser right there. And these are going for 10 bucks. They were $30. That's a really great little tea set. And then as you can see down below, lots of different options. The teacups, the teapots, the tea serving tray. $15 for those cups. We haven't shown these prices in a while. These are $20. The larger trays are $20 as well. They were 40, but if you came traveling in, that's gonna be really challenging to get home. They, I do believe they ship from the store to your home, which is always good. And then the little Dumbo trinket tray. I remember when all this stuff debuted at the D23. It was such a fun experience. I think I say that every time I see that stuff. Still lots of food and wine uh, glasses. The acrylic stem glasses are only 35 cents, so these are plastic. Yep, there you go. They're only 35 cents. The mug is $6. The little appetizer trays are really fun because you put your wine glass there, put your food there. Two bucks for those. They were $10 when you could buy them in the parks. Those are kind of nice to have. And then these are glass. I'm not going to tap these. I don't want to break them. They are long stemmed. They were $20. And I do believe they are They're cheaper somewhere. Let's see. 
This one appears to have a, there we go, $13 for those wine glasses. Nice big wine glass. Definitely want to hand wash that only because that's going to come off in the dishwasher or, you know, break your wine glass. Moving along, we have the Happy Hanukkah reverse table runners. They have the Hanukkah trays, they have the cards, they have the napkin set. These are 25, they were 60. Then we go to these nice napkins with the napkin ring. Those are $8, they were 13. The little tags are, or were 13. They're much cheaper now, but they don't have their prices on them. Oh, the gift tags are $4. And then they've got these cute little serving trays as well, going for 15. Lots of these plate sets still. These are $20, they were 55, you get four plates. And let's take a look inside at what those are again. There you go, you can kind of see what those different collections look like. And then they also have the Hanukkah wine glasses with the gold rim, the blue, the dreidel. It's a very pretty wine glass, those are $8 as you can see. Not dishwasher safe, as most things from Disney are not dishwasher safe. And then this candle which smells lovely was 25. We'll look at another one, see what if there's a discounted price on it. $20, so just a $5 discount. It's a cinnamon candle. Surprised that that hasn't come down in price considering a lot of other stuff has. Always good to check out the fig pins. They're $9, they were 25, and we've got a whole bunch of different styles to show off. So I'm just gonna cruise through them so you can see all of them really quickly. Hercules, Hades, Mike Wazowski. There's another Maleficent, there's Orange Bird, there's Woody. Then we go down more Orange Bird. We got Jafar, I don't recall seeing Jafar before. And then a whole, this whole bottom is like Maleficent and Hades. So lots of villains, very cool. All for $9. The one thing I am shocked about is there hasn't been that much 50th stuff that's shown up. Uh, you definitely don't see it in the parks anymore, but I haven't seen it here yet. They do have the Lionel train set. These are $280 still. They were like 500 bucks when they for re first retailed, so it's a really good deal. And then they also have the additional car that you can get for it, which is awesome. So it's a really cool collectible set, very nice train set. These are 150 bucks just for the extra car. Those are also $90 now. So it's a really good, it's an awesome, we haven't bought one for ourselves, but you know what, I've been tempted. I might buy one still. Apparently there's like a Bluetooth thing that you can connect to it, which is pretty cool. Haven't, haven't taken a look at that, but I think if it came down in price a little bit more, I'd buy one. So continuing on with some of the items here, we have an awesome mug that says, just roll with it from Rhea and the Last Dragon. Those are going for $6. They also still have a bunch of the mugs that we saw earlier, like the Judy Hops, Judy Rabbit, with that, I don't want to flip that top off, it's not totally secured. These are $8, the hop to it from Zootopia. They've got this mug too, this looks like it's vacuum sealed, nice mug, 10 bucks for that. Lots of fun designs all over that one as well. And then here we've got Luminous Being, Beings, and it's got Yoda on it, $8 for that mug. It's got a lightsaber with a plant coming out of it. That's interesting. All the other mugs that we've seen before, the Hawkeye mug, the Doctor Strange mug, so I don't think we need to waste too much time showing mugs that we've seen over and over and over again. They also have the hot chocolate mug from the Santa Claus, such a cool mug. These are only $8 and they have a ton of them. I am forever confused by whatever this is. It is with the mugs, it is Big Al. But there's just no way that this is an actual mug. There's no handle on it. Like, it'd be impossible to drink out of it. If it is a mug, it is strictly a decorative mug. I would never try and use it. Probably not very functional. Here's another one of those mugs that matches that throw blanket we saw earlier. $8, got Rapunzel and Moana on it. And then other princesses on the back side. Down here we have a Jafar mug. This is cool. And this looks like one of those that once it gets hot stuff in it, looks like Maybe there's something that appears there? I don't know. Insert eye roll here with Jafar. And here we have our soul mug, Joe Gardner, the Half Note Jazz Club. Those are $8 as well. They also have the cat, the 25th anniversary flubber mug going for six bucks. That movie makes me laugh so hard. It's so cheesy, but it's just fun. The Nalgene style water bottle. It's nice that it's got the measuring stuff on the side of it so you can kind of keep track of where you should be during the day and those are $8. That's kind of what the mugs are here at the Character Warehouse right now. Not a lot of new stuff, but hey, 
always good to show off. We do have some other tumblers. This is a Spider-Man one. I don't think this is from Into the Spider-Verse, but it's got a lot of the same like style on it. I think it's from that like artist interpretation collection. Those are 15 bucks. Into the Spider-Verse was awesome, by the way. Loved that. Or Across the Spider-Verse, I should say. I mean, they were both great. Can't wait for the conclusion, the third and final. I'm confused as to what's going on here, but it's like a light up mug. Okay, cool. Star Wars lights up. Why not? Always cool. Those are eight bucks. They were 35. And then we've got a Mickey Mouse mug here. Nice little plastic tumbler. Those are $8 as well. Those are 25. I don't particularly like these styles when I go to the parks because they don't keep your water cold. Whereas like the stainless steel ones typically are vacuum sealed and typically you put ice in there, it's going to last all day. So that's like my preference. These are cool, but these are a little bit more functional. I definitely want to continue on with the clothing, but it's a little bit crowded over in the clothing section. So we're gonna keep looking at some items. Got this cute little Yoda plush here. It's Yoda on Coruscant. He's got his little hover thing. Those are really $8. They were $22 when they were in the parks. And then this is really cool. This is a, a droid accessory kit from stuff that you can buy, like the Depot R series and C1 series body canisters. So I feel like, I feel like if I bought this, it will work with the, the droid that I built. I believe. Now the good news is, is these are like, they were like 65, 70 bucks and I think they're down to like 45. So I think they're 15, $20 off. Of course, the one that I pick up doesn't have its um, discounted tag on it. They were $70 when they were in the parks. As you can see, it's a really cool accessory kit. It was so challenging to pick up that I'm just not gonna do that. You can just trust me. I believe it's $45 or 40, $50. So it's really well discounted. They have some Star Wars pop figurines. These are from the Obi-Wan Kenobi show. Um, the Tala, Durith, and K Kal Colin, Kalon, I can't read, whatever. That guy, this guy's name, Colin. Like Colin, that's what it sounds like. That's what it looks like to me. I, I haven't watched this show in a while. It's, so it's, it's always weird, like, so I watched it when it first came out, but then, you know, it's been a while. They do have the third sister, Reva. She was a very popular character with lots of people, so that's kind of a nice find. They do not have the Darth Vader or Obi-Wan Kenobi. They do have the other three from the series. And let's see what they have for Star Wars clothing. Just a lot of repeat Star Wars clothing, nothing new there. But this is really cool. This is an Ahsoka shirt. He choose, he may choose his own path. This is actually really soft. This is a woman's top. It's a fun little top here, going for $20. It was a $40 top. It's a nice 50% off, plus that extra little discount they're running. More Yoda plushes over here, going for $8. These are from the Galaxy's Edge stores. And then this fun little Jawa sitting inside of a little droid head. And these are, were 22. I bet those are also $8, but it looks like they don't have any of their re reduced prices on them. All right, I found my open window where we can check out some more of the clothing. Looks like it's a bunch of stuff that we saw, we've seen before. $35 for this interesting looking top. It's not overly thick, but it would be nice in cold weather because I feel like it's, it's not like thick, it's dense. That's the word. It's like a dense material, like a, like a, your grandmother's old quilt, right? It wasn't overly like thick, but it was dense. It was heavy. And that's what these feel like to me. That's what they, they can get in a lot of grandma quilt vibes off of that style clothing there. And then lots of, it looks like sweatpants, some comfy pants. We always love a good set of comfy pants. As you can see, ooh, another nice Helly Hansen zip up. Yeah, buddy, this is really nice. I like that, it's $80. Unfortunately, just, I mean, I honest to God, I wish I could buy that just so I could wear it, but I can't because it's Florida and I, like, I'd, be wear, I'd be able to wear it like once a year. And uh, I've got other stuff that I would like to wear during that day as well. So unfortunately, no. Nice little Coca-Cola windbreaker. I just thought windbreakers were kind of worthless. Like they don't really do anything. They're not really like a heavy enough to be a real jacket, but you know, that's just me. So I don't own any, but I guess I used to own them when I was a kid. Living in Minnesota was a little more necessary. Cheshire cat pants. So colder weather environments, I feel like it's really good to have more Alice in Wonderland sweatpants. Lots of really cool sweatpants options here. So check these out. See if we can get a good look at these. So they've got the Mad Hatter on there. Alice, that rabbit. Those are $25, they were 55 bucks. The Cheshire cat pants are $15, they were 40. Check out this awesome shirt to go with it. He's got the sprout and the rabbit ears there. These are $15, that's a cool top. 
And then this little guy, I honest to God, I don't remember what this dude is from. I feel like it was Zootopia. Sure, maybe. $20, let me know if you remember down below. The only reason I say this is because it kind of matches the color animation of like what's going on here. And then they have lots of shorts. Like look at, there's so many shorts right here. We're just gonna kind of cruise through the various options. Shorts are well discounted down to $20. $18 from the $45, $40. So these are Vero Beach shorts. Of course, there was no one over here a minute ago and now it's packed, so we'll see how far I can get before I have to pause the video. But lots of cool shorts options, $25 from the Epcot 40th. And then lots of just like, looks like swim shorts or biker shorts or athletic shorts, the fun sequin skirt. Those are $25. And then they've got some swimsuit options. We're not gonna go through all that. Just a nice little handful of things. Lots of cool hats though. We missed the hat section. We might go back. Nice plain Mickey Mouse shirt for 15 bucks. It's a nice material. I feel like that would last a really long time. And then this awesome Zootopia hooded sweatshirt. No idea what the price is on that though. Looks like most of the tags have been ripped off. Nope, they're up there, $25 for those. This is a really cool Lotso shirt. Check this out. I'm really, I'm really digging this. This looks like it'd be unisex male or female. Twenty dollars for those. Nice and because they're pretty big. Like that's a medium. I feel like that looks huge. But you know, you know how it is. Uh, still, lots of these Epcot 40 shirts. I own one, the baseball style tee. That's just a long sleeve. I love it. Fits great. I keep saying if I see another medium here, I'm gonna buy another one just to have it. Yeah. $18 for this awesome little shirt here as well. And then we've got sweatpants and bottoms galore. These have been here for a while now. What's the price on those? Still $20, but you know, that 30% off, I keep saying it. Makes things a lot more palatable on the items that haven't been more discounted. So we'll see how, uh, how this all goes. I feel like there's just still tons of clothing here. They just haven't gotten rid of a lot of it, so. Maybe it's the selection, maybe it's the sizing, but we'll see over the course of the next couple weeks if that 30% off discount keeps on rolling and helps get rid of some of the clothing that's here. This is a really cool top because that's like the, the original map that's been made into a shirt. We actually have an original map from that very first year that we got for Christmas. Someone was able to find one on like eBay for us and bought it for Christmas. We were super excited. So we got it framed, put it up in our Magic Kingdom room. It's a really, it's a really, really cool piece. But they were selling replica maps uh, during the vault collection, which was really cool. So if you were able to get one, you were able to get one. These are awesome. I love the Spider-Man hooded sweatshirt. It's like a short sleeve hoodie at that Spider-Man logo. This is from the Beyond 60 Years, the 60 Years Amazing, celebrating 60 Years of Spider-Man. And then there's another style top there. Oh, dad bod shirt. This is usually the women's section, but it looks like they just kind of inter intermingled a bunch of stuff. Got an awesome uh, Spider-Man polo here. Those are $20, they were 50. That's a really cool polo, digging that. We're, now we're getting into a bunch of the Marvel stuff here. Iron Man shirts, more Thor shirts, lots of stuff that's been here for a while. This Iron Man has a really cool back on it though. Check that out. That's a really awesome back. And we like to all comic accurate stuff, comic book drawings. Those are $15, the Thor shirts are ten dollars and this is where we get into marvel items like the halloween items that we've seen a whole bunch the marvel sweatpants those are only 20 bucks this is a marvel knit top of some kind another one of those no branding things this is a 45 dollars this is the same price as that tank top we saw in the kids section the only thing that makes it marvel is the fact that it's got a tag on it but that's it okay whatever and there it is again look at that this was 45 dollars in the parks and it's Marvel because this is Marvel on it, but that's it. That's the most plain tank top. Like, I'm angry about it. Like, Disney, do better. Um, sorry about my rant. I just think it's ridiculous when they're like, oh, this is a Disney shirt because we put Disney on the tag, but there's no branding on it, and it's a $45 t-shirt that you can order on Amazon for six bucks. Like, okay, whatever. We've all overspent on something that we shouldn't have bought, though, right? It happens. And that generally wraps up this section of the clothing area. Let's see what else we can find. Now typically I've stopped showing a lot of the sweatpants because it's really hard to go around the rounders because they're so full of stuff. But these are awesome. They're like a silky 
style, like, these would feel great sleeping in. Or just lounging around in. They're $20. They were $45. They've got a whole bunch of sizes. Really fun Mickey pants. So we'll, we'll, we'll see what, yeah. And one of the other reasons I don't like going around these rounders is because, like, things are just hanging off. They're hard to get around. It's really kind of hard to show you guys. But I saw those and I was like, I have to show you guys those pants because those are awesome. Now, let's see what else there is. I'll just kind of take a look around. Some mini pants. These Pizza Planet pants. These are still, they were $70. They're down to $35, which is pretty good. It's not bad. Got a whole bunch of those. All right, let's look at and let's see, what other pants are there? These are super fuzzy. These are still 75 bucks though. They were 144. Barefoot dreams. They feel lovely. They really do. These are some tie-dye pants. These are pretty cool. I got Mickey down at the bottom. They're the jogger style, so they got the, uh, the elastic down there. This always feels weird. It feels like some like super weak person is grabbing my ankles and I don't like that feeling. Let's see what other sweatpants are. Anything good? I don't know. I just wanted to show you that these are actually not bad. These are like athletic style pants. These are 25 bucks. Sometimes it's nice to have a combination of like super fuzzy and regular sweatpants and like silky style. I guess corduroy too. Those are $25. What do these got them? They've got a little Dumbo on them. Those are so pretty. And they say Fantasyland. These are cool. Look at those. Fantasyland sweatpants. Fantastic. Those are 25 bucks. Everything else is pretty much generic, like these black ones. Are, those are, we, shot, we saw those early. And then the National Geographic. This is honestly the best time to buy this stuff because it was $110 a park down to $35 plus 30% 30 off. It's a pretty great deal. Let's check out something other than sweatpants. Not many spirit jerseys, to be honest. I only see the one from Seoul and then the food and wine one from 2022, the one that food brings the world together. These are $25. They are really cool. They're fun little... And the nice part about these is they're all different, so you can see the tie-dye pattern. It's just a little bit different on every single one. I like when they do that. It makes each piece like its own unique little thing. But it also is infuriating because like, if you see one that you're like, oh, I really like that, but it's not in your size, then you kind of have to look through them all. That's what happened with me at the Haunted Mansion one last year. I thought it was one of the coolest spirit jerseys ever. But I, when I started looking at it, I was like, man, I have to really dig through these to find the exact pattern I want. That was a big challenge. So it looks like they've got a bunch of boxer style underwear. These are really nice sleep shorts, to be honest. I own a couple different pairs of these. They're terrible, like, everyday underwear. They just are. They just they just are. Trust me on that. But they're really comfortable to sleep in. $15. Pizza Planet ones, those are $10. Zootopia ones, $13. Yeah, I've, oh, I've got a pair of uh, boxer shorts, that the Incredibles ones. Those are like my designated sleep shorts. They're fantastic, and they're so comfortable. Also love my Pizza Planet shorts. I own these. Fantastic little uh, find. Those are 15 bucks. Hard to find them in your size though. Still lots of long sleeves. We've seen these a whole bunch. If you're still watching and you're a newbie watching, just let us, just let me, just letting you know that these have been here for a long time. They're still really cool, but they've been here for a while. This is kind of a cool shirt. What is this? Oh, it's a Bahama shirt. Tommy Bahama. These are $76. It's a $150 shirt. Looks like there's only the one. And then look at this, more shorts, lots of shorts. Saw all those. We'll keep on, we'll keep moving through here. I love this shirt. I think it's a fun little shirt. This looks like a, it is a women's top. So it looks like they've kind of just got men's and women's stuff all over the place. $25 for that. And this is a weird shirt. This is like a denim. I would be so hot. But it's a Princess Tiana shirt from the Color Me Courtney collection. $25. Bounce through a couple other shirts. The the bowling pizza planet shirt. It's awesome. It's a great shirt. 25 bucks for that. Let's see what else we can find. The battery's starting to run low. We've taken a little bit more time than we usually do because I felt like there's a lot of stuff to show. I wanted to give you a good update on what the clothing section looked like since it is 30% off still. Let's see anything new that's really awesome. Look at this. This is just a great white shark shirt. So cool. What does that go for? Probably like 30 bucks. $13. Awesome. Let's see. Yeah, and these are so jam-packed. It's just it's hard to you gotta yank on the shirts to pull them out. That's a really cool Paging Mr. Morrow shirt. That's $13. Oh. More Aristocat shirts. So lots of Aristocat shirt. Oogie Boogie Pest Control. So there are quite a few newer shirts here. Of course, I pull out the Buzz Lightyear one. It's been here since the movie got released a year ago. Lots of the Epcot stuff from Epcot 40th, more Star Commander stuff, and then the, and then the 
yeah, these these little blue house things. I mean, this whole section here is all little blue house. So they, they obviously clearance out a lot of that. Um, so it's here. It's really well priced. And you get pajamas for the family and sweatshirts for the family and all that good stuff. So we're going to call it there. I think we've been looking around the store long enough. I think we've covered a lot of really cool stuff. Thank you so much for watching. And um, we'll see you on our next video. I'm sure it'll be character warehouse style or maybe from the parks or from Disney Springs or something. Be sure to check out some of our previous videos. There's a lot of really cool merchandise at the parks right now. And of course, we just need to do more videos to show you what all of that is. So we'll see you guys on the next video and I hope you have a magical day.